Hey guys, I hope you're doing well. Thank you for clicking on this video. Today is going to be slightly different. It's going to be a tutorial on how I curl and style my hair with these amazing Kaposi V7 2-in-1 curler and straighteners. So, I'm very excited to show you because these are an absolute bargain and they work an absolute treat as you're going to see in a second. They are a bargain of £37.99 and they are available on Amazon Prime too which is super super handy and I will pop the links and the discount code that I've got for you in the description box below. So if you use the code V7Beauty, I'll put it on the screen and in the description box, it takes off £7.60 for you so you can get these for an amazing total of £30.39. When you see how they work, you're going to put them in your basket. They have a little display screen which I love, obviously they're off at the moment. The cable's super long so I'm able to plug it in over there and still do it here. You turn it up and you can see the temperature that you've set it to. So with my thick extensions I set it to around 200 but they go up to 230 degrees. And with my natural hair which is a lot thinner I usually use it about 160 degrees. It then shows you that it's heating up so it's now at 90 degrees, super super fast at heating up. And I've put heat protector spray on my hair as I've washed and dried it just before this. So it's all protected and ready to be curled. But as I'm waiting for them to heat up, I just quickly brush through my hair to make sure there's no knots. And that it will glide through very easily. I then separate my hair into layers so that I do the bottom layer first, then the middle section, then the top section. So now that we've got our sections, I'm going to take a small piece of the bottom layer, clamp it at the top of the straighteners, flip the hair around, pull the hair down, and wait for the magic to happen. You can roll it back up like this. <gasps> Look at that. Can you see that? I just think that's incredible. They've got like a kind of curved edge so it works perfectly for the curl. And then I pop that to the back so that it has time to set itself and they will stay all day long. And we go for the next one, flip it over, and then I will show you on a sped up version, I guess, doing loads of them. And we will see the final result. Wow. And on this side, same thing. That's my bottom layer done. So whilst that is kind of setting, I just get some hairspray and just lightly spritz that and then leave that to the back and I'll brush through it at the end. So I get the next layer down and I put my fringe up separately from this. do that at the end <laughs> we work through these pieces exactly the same as before amazing reviews on Amazon as well because I always look at the reviews as they're super important as obviously it's people's honest opinions and they've got 4.6 stars out of 5 and their reviews are amazing so how's everyone feeling in this very very strange time that we're going through at the moment 2020 for me is pretty much a write-off I'm ready to go into 2021 um, we all have to remain positive, don't we? But this year's been a bit of a struggle. It's been a struggle. Comment below and let me know how you're getting on and how you're finding it. Um, and we can all have a bit of a chat in the comments below. That is the second layer done. You can see it looks super voluminous. 
The curls are amazing and I'm going to brush them out at the end so they'll look a lot more smooth and sleek. Um, but for now I just let them set. Spray a bit more hairspray. And then do the fringe. Here we go. I've just finished curling every little bit and going over any bits that I feel needed a bit more whoomp at the top. I just pull it out that way then go back that way. I'm going to turn the straighteners off now. You simply just twist the bottom and they are off and safe to leave at the side. I'm going to spray the top but not too much. This is the moment of truth. I take a brush, same one, and I slowly, you can either take a brush and brush it out or you can use your fingers, but I quite like to just use a brush and just slowly tease it out. There you go, see the difference? So sometimes I, I quite like it like that and you don't have to brush it out, but I quite like it where it's like glam kind of curls, you know? And just brush. I also will link in the description below where my hair extensions are from um, and who did them for me. I'll put that all in the description box. And there we go, that is the final look. I am so impressed with these, honestly I am. I use them all the time now and because I have extensions in the curls last for like three to four days so it's a dream for me. Um, I often pin this bit up like this, I quite like that look and yeah. Any questions or anything, pop them in the comments below. Hope you enjoyed this video and take care, stay positive, lots of love to you and lots more cover videos coming soon. Mwah.